The following is a YouTube comment posted by Critical Elixir to the Alt Shift X video Valyrian Steel. The comment was posted on January the 22nd, 2018. Stop lying to our children. Those artifacts are Indian and some alien. The early Indians were the Israelites' drifters of Moses' time, so those are never more than about 6,500 years old. Satan told us all this. Satan chased most of God's people into USA. Jeremiah hid the Ark of the Covenant in South Ohio. Swords. All metallurgy was controlled only by Lucifer to keep humans dumbed down, oppressed. The violent Indians were aliens, equals fallen angels and co, survivors of Atlantis and Lemuria and etc. If you think a human made many of those arrowheads, try it. Try making one. But then, many humans today are demons placed in wombs. Lucifer erases their memories. Do a little research how cement is made. All fossils were from the Noah Flood. Satan lies about their age. Note, in Noah's day, there was no sun, so all fossils are mostly ferns and such. Noah never saw rain. A mist would come up nights from below. Cement is made through exclusion of oxygen. Same happens with tons of mud, silt. The reason they always stone age is because Lucifer oppressed them. Also, the one only reason technology exploded 1900 is because Lucifer has to enforce his RFID mark. He will be jailed, and so must kill all his breeding stock, which he eats through horrific torture. Those fossils aren't five million years ago. The solar system was heaven once. Lucifer was breeding Neanderthal and dinosaurs when Yahweh built Eden. That is why Eden was fenced and guarded. Satan told us the dinos were in Americas only. The fossils you find were only produced during Noah's flood. Mud produces quick cement. Read book Interview with the Devil, Sherry Schreiner. Yahweh Creator reveals history of our solar system. See Link. The Most High has a team of elite cutting-edge warriors on Earth. I work with them where it comes to a tip. I have been allowed to listen in when Yahweh speaks from the throne. We have also been interviewing Lucifer. Lucifer has a mind eraser, downloader. He clones people he murders. Of course, you bring up other issues. Lucifer can download you to become a violinist if you sell your soul. He used to advertise with sellouts. Anymore, he just kills you if you sign out. Here is a useful copy and paste I wrote for other video, teaching how to build quartz weapon of Yah. Yahweh also revealed history of our solar system, who rep reptilian are, etc. Yahweh explained to me Giza is his. Fallen angels produce all these videos that lie to our children. To find Fallen Angels YouTube, follow the popularity trail. Follow the money trail. They are very skilled, charming producers. They possess an obvious overriding void, however. They never mention Yahweh legitimately, if at all. Dinosaurs, endless question marks, and leave that for you to decide, are their trademarks. Just to give you an idea, behind the scenes, they literally tie up humans they can manage to acquire and torture them while family members are forced to watch. Texas Hurricane, Yah informed us these angels kidnapped and are killing 50,000 people. Government is them. It is not your friend. FEMA is them. If you see someone on TV with a camera pointed at them now, it's one of them. Yahweh is about to produce a worldwide sign now, and he will remove his light off the earth, and Pole, Flip, and Lucifer's RFID reign will begin. It will be a time horrific beyond imagination. Hence, a quartz energy weapon is required. Orgon blasters. Google how to make. Lucifer built all the other pyramids to mock Giza. 
For example, in 1988 I was becoming world's best guitarist. Lucifer stood up 12 guys to try to replace me. Lucifer hates having to inspire you with music, but will when cornered. Music now primarily only points to Lucifer by design, if it is inspiring at all. Yahweh stated recently, Lucifer enjoyed destroying the spirits of all those who adored him. Truther's videos YouTube typically do exactly that extinguishing your spiritual light. Claiming Noah built Giza, again to make a biblical connection, seems ridiculous. Giza. Giza is like a stamp. It is the creator's mark and says, Earth is mine. Garden of Eden was just beside it and is under Gulf Aden now. Eden was fenced and guarded because Lucifer had dinosaurs in USA at that time when Landmass joined, and there were Neanderthals Lucifer made to promote evolution. Basically, the solar, the solar system was heaven once. Yahweh had 12 direct children. Each child had a planet. Lucifer was Lord's elder brother. God created two warrior girls when Lucifer, then Haleel, began to fall. Those two now live on Earth as warriors, promoting a weapon all humans are required now to build. Yahweh provides instructions, Orgon Blaster's website. After the war with Lucifer, our 14 planets were laid waste. Lucifer's planet became our asteroid belt. The angels secured Pleiades, Mercury, and the Sun. Yahweh's throne is in the Sun. Pleiadians you see are devils mocking angels. Lucifer created to Orion, and tried to rebuild this system. Yahweh then stationed near Eden, created Adam, Lilith who joined Satan, and so Eve was then created. Giza does not have Egyptian writings inside, it has Yahweh's instead, and camera verified it was built by the Hebrew god. Giza cannot be entered by humans, however. Yahweh recently created multi-dimensional creatures to guard Antarctica's angelic artifacts, same with Giza. Giza is a portal, and has a king and a queen chamber inside. Solomon used to command demons to aid in building for him. Yahweh employs them also. For example, Lucifer has been anointed to enforce the RFID mark of the beast. Lucifer has told us he will go door to door six months to a year. If you receive that mark, it's a ticket to hell. Hide during that time. Yahweh is about to flip Earth's poles. Then RFID chip in force will begin. It will clean Earth of evil people. Giza was white with a gold top. The same all-seeing eye Lucifer has you thinking is the height of Illuminati evil. Giza originally had a winged lion in front. Lucifer mocks it with his sphinx. Yahweh's two warrior daughters are about to leave Earth within days, Shazarazi and Rashael. Shazarazi has a YouTube channel where she is known as Sherry Shriner. When you see satanically educational truthers vids videos or any injustice, you can simply elicit Yahweh that an angel destroy the YouTube channel. They will be glad to do so. Make sure you address your prayer in God's Son's name. YouTube doesn't monitor YouTube. Yahweh overrides all. Lucifer influenced half the Bible. His name isn't Jesus, it's Yahshua. They used to call him Yasha in heaven. God is not in your churches. Lead my people back to me. If you're watching this video, you want truth. Ask Creator to give you truth in all things. Example, Yahweh has been revealing history of our solar system. SherryShriner.blogspot.com slash 2016 slash 05 slash The Awakening Part 4B interview with. Yahweh has an RFID also. It's baptism. Even Yasha got baptized. If you have not received the Creator's mark, he cannot help you when Lucifer's forces come for you. Truthers vids today are like pulling a rapist pants down and exposing how his penis works. Where is talk of a solution, or how aliens fit into creation? Where is mention of Yahweh, mention of weapons to defend ourselves? Yahweh has provided a multi-dimensional quartz weapon. You are required to build it. Winged reptilian are fallen angels. Yahweh turned Lucifer and his angels into reptiles when he mated with Adam's wife. These videos leave us with a doctorate in Satanism, and our children are left with graphic images. 
If we continue only exposing truth in absence of pointing to God as solution, that void makes us not much better than a Satanist.